Hi guys, it's Mandy from Mandy Lee Plays, and in this video, I'm going to give you my recent gaming pickups. So this is for the month of May and April. I did February, down in February, if you want to check that out. But yeah, these are for these two months. So let's get started. So my first game is Overcooked All You Can Eat. Yeah, sorry about the glare on this one. <laughs> it still has the plastic. Anyways, I got this because my friend, a uh, Nintendo gamer gal, was playing it and I really wanted to get into it and I wanted to play with her. And plus it has crossplay, so you could play with people on the PC, the PlayStation, the Xbox, and the Switch. So it's pretty neat and this one has all the DLC and it has both Overcooked 1 and Overcooked 2. So this is the definitive edition of Overcooked and yeah, I'm glad I got it and I can't wait to start playing it with Gamer Gal and stuff. Her channel will be linked below. She's the inspo for this game. Like I didn't really look at this game until I played it with her and I was like, oh man, this is kind of fun. So I picked it up myself. So the next game I got was a Monster Hunter Deluxe Edition. You guys know I love this game to death. It is one of my favorite games of the year, if not my favorite game of the year. I don't really know, the year hasn't ended, but it came out strong. And there's recent DLC in this game, so I'm still playing it to this day. And I just love it so much. I have a review, an impressions, and a tips video. I'll leave it linked somewhere over here or in the description. So please check those out if you haven't. But needless to say, I love this game. A lot. Alright, so the next game is gonna seem like a random game, but I've been eyeing this game forever. I just was waiting for a sale because I'm not paying full price for this type of game. And that is Tsum Tsum Festival. It's still in its plastic, so don't mind the glare. And yeah, it was on sale on Amazon. I think it was 10 bucks, so I scooped it up finally. It's kind of like a mini game style uh, party game, but with Tsum Tsums. And Tsum Tsums are little beanie thingies you get at Disney. And they have them for all the Disney characters. So admittedly, I wanted this game because it looks cute AF. I love Tsum Tsums. I love collecting them. Though I don't collect them as much anymore. But when I was younger, I used to love Tsum Tsums. Like, oh my god. <laughs> Alright, and the next game is Story of Seasons, Pioneers of Olive Town. Now, I actually did an unboxing for this one. And I'm doing a stream series for it too link over here or down there you know the drill and needless to say i love this game so much it is so 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 relaxing i love farming sims so i knew what i was getting into and it delivers on what i was expecting a little bit more but it is so chock full of stuff and farming and relationships it's a lot but it's a very relaxing game and i've seen a lot of people compare it to um animal crossing which no, not really. It's very chill and calming like Animal Crossing, don't get me wrong. And it's a very good game for like Animal Crossing channels to really dip their toes in. But it's nothing like Animal Crossing in the gameplay department. So they're different. They still have that chill factor and I guess that's why people combine them a lot. But they're different games. So yeah, Story of Seasons, good game, good game. And I'm still streaming it over on my channel. I had to move it to Sunday, and last Sunday I was playing Persona Strikers, but now that I finished Persona Strikers, I'm going to go back to Story of Seasons for a Sunday chill stream. Because like I said, it's a chill game. Alright, here is where the newer stuff comes. Now, I did get a Near Replicant. Hold on, the, the camera's got to focus. I have to figure out how to do this without the glare. Anyways. I got near replicant version 1.22474487139. And no, that's not a serial number. That is the actual title of this game. Good luck going into Walmart and saying to that lady, hey, can I have near replicant version 1.22747474487139? She's gonna look at you crazy. She's gonna look at you crazy. So just say near replicant, same thing. But yeah, I recently bought this game. I don't think I'm ready for the feels, but now that I finished Persona Strikers, I'm gonna dive right into this baby. Now, if you guys want me to stream it, tell me in the comments down below. 
but I'm gonna play it nonetheless. So yeah, just tell me down below if you want me to stream it. And I played Near Automata. It is one of my favorite games of all time, of all time. Like it's right up there next to Zelda. So it's I, I hold this series with a high regard. It's so it's so nice to be able to play it and not just hear about it kind of vibe. Back then it was called Near and it had the dad near, not the brother near. The dad near looked ugly. <laughs> it looked really ugly. You don't know how excited I am for this. Anyways, on to my next game, and that is Super Mario Party. Now, I got this three years later because Nintendo, out of the freaking goddamn blue, was like, Hey, here's an update that you've been wanting for three years, and that is online multiplayer. It came out of nowhere. It took everyone by surprise. It did um, boost sales for this game. But yeah, that was kind of weird. So, complaining does work. And it's actually the only thing the consumer has at their disposal to really make changes happen. Before you go attacking that person who wants a certain feature in a game, really think about it because we are the people who are making changes to the games that you enjoy. So you're welcome. Anyways, I went on a rant that wasn't supposed to go, but hey, I said what I need to say. And my next game is New Pokemon Snap. Now this game is a cult classic and I didn't play the 64 version and I'm really excited to see what all the hullabaloo is about and why taking pictures of Pokemon is so fun. So <laughs> I got the game and yeah. Alright and the next item is not a game actually, it's a book. I know. And that is, oh my god it is dirty. Ask a water? Ask a water questions? Okay, that joke wasn't funny. I've seen this all over Twitter and I had to get it. It says, words of wisdom from Satoru Iwata, Nintendo's legendary CEO. A lot of things we could learn from Mr. Iwata. A lot of stuff. Okay, I need to stop with the jokes. And then I have some miscellaneous stuff that I got. First, I got a Pusheen plushie. Um, it's playing what looks like to be a Switch and it has headphones on. And on the same vein, I got a shirt chilling, playing what looks to be a Switch, and saying I am busy. I vibe with this shirt so bad. <laughs> and next I got the 200 podcast anniversary uh, t-shirt from Spawncast. I'm gonna make it to the 300, just you wait. But yeah, this is the 200 one. I have the 100 one, and I love these shirts. They're really good quality. I wear my 100 one all the time. They're very comfy, and I just like to support the peeps on it from what i could tell i see oh i see avadon i know the one who says objection is scott the was i don't know who that freaking dill pickle is probably rich from review tech i know rgt because he has the hat that says rgt and same with dreamcast guy he has a hat oh the one that's persona is probably omni okay that didn't dawn on me <laughs> Okay, I need to stop. Lastly, I got the Monster Hunter Pro Controller. Oh, look at that beauty. Look at that beauty. I just got it because my OG one is literally the one I bought day one. So it's like four years old. So I grabbed it and I have no regrets. I have no regrets. It looks beautiful. It looks beautiful. And I love Monster Hunter Rise, so yay. So that is my gaming pickups for March and April. I did do a room overhaul and my desk is completely new and all that stuff. If you want to look at that, I have a setup tour, which I'll put here in the description down below. And I think it's a good video, so please check that out. So tell me what you guys think in the comments down below. Did you guys get anything for March and April or any other months? What games are you excited for? Did any of the games I present you have two that you love please let me know i love hearing from you guys if you like this video please hit that like button i would appreciate it and it does really help and if you're new to this channel hello my name is mandy um please hit that subscribe button if you like the content and would love to see more you will not be disappointed so with all that being said hope you guys have a fabulous rest of the day and a fabulous weekend and as always play a good game peace peace